Well, you figured out how to turn off my... They turn off my video and the flash. How the hell do you do that? Not cool. Not cool. How did you do that? He did growl something like figure it out or he'll figure it out. But I thought he was talking about knocking that cigarette off the lantern. Not turn off my video. Of course, I can't prove the spirit did that. Not unless I video my phone with another phone. Can you spirits move that cigarette off the purple lantern, please? Just push it on the ground. Very simple. It weighs next. Weighs next to nothing. Come on, do something dramatic. Yeah, that was my stomach growling. Light up something on the piano. Play the piano. You'd probably do it if I was a pretty lady instead of a guy. Right? I don't know if you're capable of doing it. I think you might be too weak. Two people on the tour got sick. One guy, like right in the beginning, and apparently from this room. Or the. Well, it might have been the other room, too, but they, they said both. <clears throat> Do you spirits make Chris sick? I'm surprised they did that because the spirits here are, at least I thought they were pretty nice and mellow. It doesn't necessarily mean that they're evil when they do that. It could be, um, <clears throat> it's hard to explain, like, um, portraying how they felt when they passed away or... You know, who knows? Where's the deep voice grouchy guy from room nine? Has he come through yet? You got two ladies in your room, a mother and a daughter. They're in room nine, the Lipton room. What do you think about that? What was that I heard? You trying to knock off the cigarette?
interesting human. What's interesting? It's like he said, interesting your work. So why can't you guys do physical things like move stuff when you're being asked to do it? Is that too hard? Is it too hard to move stuff on cue? Sorry, scratching my nose. Oh my gosh, these honey roasted almonds are addicting. I shouldn't be gobbling these. Come on, talk to me. I drove all this way to be here with you. Can you say my name? They have that coming. They have that coming. K2 is going off. They have what coming? Oh, I mean, he might be talking about them getting sick. Really, and I'm getting like a cold. They're getting cold all of a sudden. I was hot like minutes ago. So you. You're saying Chris and the other guy had it coming? What, you making them sick? Why? What'd they do? You can't open that door. Remove one of the robes. Or that cigarette. Come on, that cigarette weighs nothing. You should be able to do that. Easy peasy. You can't blow it or knock it off. Except for that prostitute one in Mark Twain room. That was interesting. So she's been a prostitute all her adult life. 
hope I can find that video because I was recording it. Are you here, prostitute lady? Try not to use the W word. <laughs> I don't know if it had the same derogatory meaning now or back then as it does now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hmm, okay, so horror was bad back then, too. So what did you call those type of women that did that work? Did you call them soiled doves? Did you call them ladies of the night? Harlot sluts? Prostitutes. <laughs> What'd you call them? Hmm? Still waiting for you to knock that cigarette off the purple lantern. Oh boy, what was that? You get what I mean. I'm starting to nod off there. If you talk about the prostitute spirits, I, I guess that could be relevant. I really wish you guys would knock something over, not break it, but like that cigarette. Balancing on top of the purple lantern. Or, I don't know, opening this door, knocking a rope down, knocking one of the stuffed animal bears down. trouble keeping my eyes open you guys gotta help keep me awake say something do something knock over a cigarette come on easy peasy lemon squeezy I'm double dog daring you I bet you cannot Knock that cereal off of there. Cereal, oh my god, I'm so tired. Cigarette. Oh lord. <laughs> yeah, this is almost like a lethargy. It's. I've been sleep deprived.
What the hell? I just heard that door. Nobody's in that room. Did you try to open that door? Yeah, it's like somebody like leaned against it. Why don't you open another door? This glass partition door, can't you open it? Just push. What do you guys do for fun? You said council? That's what you do for fun? Knock that cigarette off the purple lantern. What's that? I don't know what that was. Was something lit up? Ooh, not good. That's a six six six. That is not the temperature in here. Are you trying to imply there's something evil in here? Six, six, six. I don't think so. What is this one? Six, six, oh, three. That sounds like no. I don't know what temperature it is, but I seriously doubt it's 666. You playing the game? They might try messing with me when I do fall asleep. <sighs> Close the what? You close the what? Someone said close an RB, but I think I heard that one wrong. <laughs> that is not budging from 666. Are you trying to make it like the devil's here? Devil in the Ulysses S. Grant room at the Murphy's Hotel. You're just not going to knock down that little cigarette, are you? Just because I asked you to. Because it's easy to do. Oh, this spear is not lighting up. Does the battery die? Well, What's going on here? Hey. 
did Grant really stay in this room? Can you tell me what year he was in this room? I just heard that. Are you trying to open that door? Close these windows, it is getting kind of chilly in here. At least one of them. Oops, I do the wrong. Why don't you scare us do something spooky? Did you do anything spooky? I don't remember that oven being open. Is that open? I think I'm going to stop this video because it's getting too long. <laughs>